Hey y'all, it's Ashley bringing you uh, two 8.5 by 11 layouts for my Project Life album. So I am starting off with two photos that I didn't was not able to fit in the last uh, spread. And so I decided to just add in two um, separate layouts, which I think works out perfectly because these are two uh, pretty important photos for this particular week. So um, this is still on week two, which I know I have a long way to go because this is still 2015. But um, I did start in June because that was when my daughter was born. So I mentioned that in the, I think the first video that I um, made for this series. So this is just random things from tons of collections. They're, I think, like the Amelia is it the Amelia collection or Baxter from Studio Calico? Something like that. And then um, there's stuff from the from crepe paper, like notes and things. And then I think that the little ephemera piece that says today is the best is from the Fine and Dandy collection. And then I think that even the vellum pieces are from like older crepe paper lines. So I um, decided that I wanted to add some circle elements around the focal point, which is the photo. So I wasn't planning on doing that, but I had these little things that I had pulled prior to starting the layout. And so I just started kind of placing the circle pieces around and then thought, okay, I, I think I like that. So I now I'm looking through this little um, tray that I have sitting on the side. Um, and I got those from the dollar spot, like a few years ago. I think somebody's asked about those before. And um, yeah, those are from the dollar spot, but it was like a few years ago. So I'm not sure if there would be any place where they you could find them now. But um, I found this little, the, the little wood veneer piece that's circle is, also, is actually like stamping up. But I mean, you can stamp on them yourselves, but, and I've done that before, but I decided, I found this little epoxy sticker from Amy Tangerine and I decided to um, put the number three on there. So that's uh, appropriate for the occasion. This is when uh, Ava got discharged from the hospital. So um, I had the nurse take a picture of us. So now I'm moving on to um, the second layout. And this is a picture of her in the car. And of course, I sat in the back with her. <laughs> and I did for like the first couple months of her life when David would drive um, and he was home for the summer and so and I was off of course and so anytime he would drive I would sit back there and then we got to the point where she was totally fine in the car seat like by herself in the back seat so um, and, and and to this day now I mean I don't sit back there with her unless for some reason she's like upset but that's pretty rare um, so this is her and for you know for the first time in her car seat and um, I thought, you know, I kind of started thinking like I did circle on the other page and I decided, or circle elements on the other layout. And so I decided to just kind of stick with more square ish elements, even though I do add some circle things here in a second, but I just thought that was kind of cool to mix it up. And so I'm using a lot of the same colors that I've been using in the album. Um, I'm, doesn't mean I'm going to stick with those colors throughout the whole, uh, album, but I for these two pages, they do go with week two. So I thought I could kind of stick with the same color scheme. Plus I have a lot of the mints and the black and white and the um, pinks and stuff like that. I mean, I feel like that's, that makes up the majority of my stash. So I really wanted to force that LA studio flower to work, but I couldn't get it to um, fit in there. So I just decided to kind of move on and find something else that might fit. So I found this little notes and things arrow and oh um, is that notes and things I think that might actually be that's either notes and things or the lucky charm collection that like the little project life mini kit I think I got it from Amazon and it has all gold foiling on it so I am trying to figure out how I'm going to add in my journaling and I decided to do it on a like a mint piece of vellum that I got from Michaels and then I just sewed that down and the last um thing I'm going to do is add uh, India ink to both of my pages and that's pretty much it and I have some quite a few close-ups here so you guys can kind of see it a little bit um, in more detail so I hope you guys enjoyed and have a great weekend and have a great week